question often asked is, how do I drive valuation in my business, exponential growth, while also making sure I have time for my loved ones? First and foremost, I think there's five things to consider. The first one is vision. Know what the hell you want. Surprising how few business leaders can really articulate that. You got to have the answer to the question, where the hell are we going? It gives clarity. It helps communication, which you have to keep giving over and over, and aligns your organization to where you want to go. Second thing is, boy, I'll tell you, cash. You got to know your numbers. Be aware of them. What are the key indicators? What are the monthly cash flow statements telling you? Even a daily cash report for some people. And projections over time. Know your cash. Know your numbers. Three, build the best team possible. But Mike, you don't understand. It's so hard to hire people. You just got to get people in the building. Yes. Unfortunately, that has happened and it may continue. But when you have a critical employee, get in there, take the time and find a way to get the right person, keep the environment you're trying to create, heading in the right direction and continually attracting top talent. Key relationships. You got to fucking own them. Do you know which ones they are? Suppliers, employees, the more critical people in your organization or people that supply things to your organization that you know who they are and you own those relationships, the less likely you're going to be surprised. Spend some time on that. Who are they? Invest time with them. Finally, intellectual curiosity is the number one trait of business leader in my mind. Learning. Stay relevant. What's happening in your industry, outside your industry, in your community? What's happened around the world? Is there impact on my business and what's going on in my life? I'd say the same kind of things for your home life, guys, because you want to grow this exponentially, but you also want to get closer here. Send me some thoughts. I'd love to hear them in this pick of the case because I know this is a tough one for a lot of people to do both of these. Reality is always going to win. Be ready.